Jai Guru Dev children welcome to cups and bulbul session now we are going to learn about square knot or reef knot first we will see how to tie the reef knot step 1 cross the blue and red ends step 2 pass the red end through the blue loop step 3 pull the ends to tighten finally the knot is complete Now we are going to see videos on how to tie a reef knot. How to tie a reef knot. The reef knot, also known as the square knot, is as simple as tying your shoes. In fact, it is tying your shoes. You will need a single length of rope. Optional, a second length of rope. Step 1. Hold one end of the rope in your left hand and the other in your right hand. Step 2. Cross the end of the rope in your left hand over the end in your right hand to form an X. Step 3. Bring the end of rope in your left hand down behind the end in your right hand, then back up so that the two ends are entwined. The left hand rope is now in your right hand and vice versa. Step 4. Use your right hand to pass the same end back over the end now in your left hand, forming another X. Step 5. Bring that end down behind the other end again and continue pulling it through the loop that forms. This knot can also be tied using two separate ropes, joining them in a hitch. Step 6. Pull the two ends to a symmetrical length and you've got a perfect square reef knot on your hands. Did you know? Mm -hmm. A helpful mnemonic device to tie this knot. Left over right, right Now we are going to learn about uses of reef knot. To join the two ends of a rope, it is used to tie parcels and bandages. It is used to join with an object and to tie cattles. Children, I hope that you all understood how to tie a reef knot. Thank you.